Hey guys, welcome to this video. If you're new here, I'm April. I'm a skincare and cosmetic chemist. I talk about all things skincare, back end, front end of all things skincare. So if you're interested in that, definitely hit that like button for me down below. Subscribe to the channel because we're here every week, every single week, talking about skincare. All right, y'all, Mandelic Acid. Mandelic Acid. I made a video about Mandelic Acid on my TikTok and they loved it. They ate it up and I made a few suggestions. Mandelic Acid is an AHA by the way. It's an alpha hydroxy acid that helps to exfoliate the skin and it just helps to prevent acne and it helps to, you know, exfoliate and remove dead skin cells from your skin and help your skin. It's basically like a facial, you know what I mean? Like a at-home facial. When you compare it to glycolic and lactic acid, it has bigger molecules so it penetrates skin of color a lot slower but effective. But you got to give it some time. But Mandelic Acid, when it comes to dosage, it's one of those AHAs where the higher mandelic acid is, the better. Compared to glycolic, where you kind of have to stay below 10% mark to not irritate your skin, mandelic acid actually thrives in higher percentages. So we're going to talk about mandelic acid today. And I'm going to give you some of my recommendations and the ones that you shouldn't use. First one you shouldn't use is this one by Selfless by Hara and you to the people. This one has 3% mandelic acid. Although a great product, it obviously is too low and wouldn't work. It's 3%. It's just, we're talking years to see result at this point. So I would not use this mandelic acid. Next one is this one by Wish Trend. It only has 5% and this one by Vivant, 8%. These two are just too low, too, too, too low to see results. Maybe a year, maybe a year and a half, but it's just still too long. A lot of people don't have the patience for that. Now my first choice is this one by Chemist Confessions, 18% mandelic acid. And let me tell you, the results, mwah, results are quicker, like obviously not as fast as maybe glycolic acid or maybe even lactic, but sis, the results are there. The results are resulting. This one by Naturium at 12% and this one by Allies of Skin at 11% is also just as great. The one from Inculus and Ordinary Aboot at 10% and those ones work great also, but honestly, if you want to start slow, I will start with the one by the Ordinary and the Inculus and then work my way to the Cummings Confessions one, but you can't go wrong with any of these last three. But yeah, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know your thoughts on my Mandelic acid, which one are you loving right now? As usual, don't forget to like and subscribe and comment to win the giveaway by the end of the video. But yeah, that's it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.